okay namaste everyone namaste today we are discussing about some important proof of binomial hope you are enjoying in my session in my class and in my series as well uh, very important questions and their concept we are discussing if you have any confusion let me know i will deal in that now the question goes like this the question is so that the coefficient the coefficient of of the middle middle term of 1 plus x to the power 2n is equal to the sum of the coefficient coefficient of the two middle terms of 1 plus x to the power 2n minus 1 this is a question now we have to solve this question yeah we have to solve this question first of all uh, yeah solution are the proof dear students yeah first of all let's uh, discuss in uh, details yeah the general term the general term of 1 plus x to the power 2n the general term of 1 plus x to the power 2n is given by tr plus 1 equal cnr an minus r xr we, we know this then what is an that is 2n it is this equal here i have written c instead that n is 2n r and a is 1 so 1 to the power 2n minus r x to the power r equal c 2n r x r power of this n r are positive integers then uh, that the power of 1 will be the 1 then we will obtain this first part is this yeah then the number the number of terms in the expansion in the expansion of 1 plus x to the power 2n is 2n plus 1 you know that if there is 2n then there are one more terms while expanding this if there are this is odd one yeah uh, which is is this which is odd which is odd so there there is only one middle term or simply if this is even 2n is always even if even uh, power is or index is given there then there are how many uh, there are only one middle term that understood we can uh, find in that way so dear students for the middle terms for the middle term 
for the middle term root r equal index by 2 that is 2n by 2 equal to n therefore r equal to n if there is only one middle term the r is index or power this power by 2 you can use 2n by 2 equal to n equal to r equal to n so t n plus 1 equal that is tr plus 1 is uh, c 2n n times x to the power n there are other methods also uh, i have explained in this way for this question therefore the coefficient of n plus one term is c to n n this is the case first tn plus 1 the coefficient coefficient of n plus 1 the term or this one is x to the power n is yeah now coefficient of middle term of this is we obtain this 2n comma n yeah equal to we have to prove equal to the sum of the coefficient of two middle terms of 1 plus x to the power 2 n minus 1 we have to find the middle terms of um, two middle terms of this uh, 1 plus x to the power 2 n minus 1 we have to find their sum which is equal to this uh, coefficient of the middle terms okay dear students now moving to the next part moving to the next part Uh, now similarly general term of 1 plus x to the power 2n minus 1 is given by tr plus 1 equal c 2n minus 1 comma r x to the power r and this is odd one 2n minus 2n is even minus 1 is the odd terms is 2n minus 1 is odd so there are two middle Trumps. I already explained if this is or there are even number of x um, trumps while expanding this then if there are even number of trumps then there will be two middle trumps yeah so to find the middle trumps there are two middle trumps mm, and <clears throat> for mm, first middle term <clears throat> for first middle trump we have to find r by putting r equal in that case for first middle terms that index minus 1 by 2 we can use this pattern index is 2n minus 1 minus 1 by 2 equal n minus 1 remember r equal to index minus 2 i will justify this here also dear students it will be very interesting uh first we need the pattern of tr plus 1 form we have to develop this form to apply this so in uh, the term is the middle term is tn plus 1 by 2 is the middle term this is a middle term but we have to convert into r plus 1 form so for this n plus 1 by 2 you can write t n minus 1 by 2 plus 1 in this pattern you can uh, change right and what is the value of n that is 2n minus 1 after 
putting the value of 2n minus 1 it will be uh, mm, let me use okay same sign t 2n minus 1 minus 1 by 2 plus 1 then then what will you get yes uh, what will you get that's 2n minus 2 by 2 n minus 1 by 2 okay i will take this special so this will be t 2n minus 2n minus 2 by 2 plus 1 t 2n 2 is common 2 is common n minus 1 by 2 plus 1 then again this space is not enough i'll drop this later one don't worry about that then t is this cancel n minus 1 plus 1 <clears throat> okay then this is r this is 1 so n minus 1 is the value of r so we can convert this way this is the justification how we get why we use index minus 1 by 2 yeah so it is explained this way you have to load in that way okay i think you got it now i want to rob this now I have justified now so this is the pattern mm -hmm. so r is uh, uh, n minus 1 by uh, r is n minus 1 in this case yeah so simply this is n minus 1 now dear students after finding the value of r uh, in general term we get 3 n minus 1 plus 1 equal r plus 1 form is c 2 n minus 1 n minus 1 times x to the power n minus 1 this is xr and therefore the coefficient mm, the coefficient coefficient is c 2n minus 1 comma n minus 1 this is second case first part okay now move to the next part dear students we have to move to the next part again for second middle term again for second middle term we have to put r equal index minus 1 by 2 plus 1 equal to n minus 1 minus 1 by 2 plus 1 equal n you can find by simplification minus 2 that n minus 1 plus 1 1 1 cancel n will be the answer so r is therefore r is n we obtain in general form in general term we get hmm, t n plus 1 equal c 2 n 2 n minus 1 comma n x to the power n this pattern is because r plus 1 is n plus 1 form therefore the coefficient the coefficient is is c 2n minus 1 comma n this is third condition we can write this is a third condition now moving to the next part finally yeah in first part in second and third part what we obtain in second part c 2n minus 1 comma n minus 1 this is the coefficient of middle term and another is c 2 n minus 1 comma n equal c 2 n comma n we have to show this finally we have to prove this 
sum of this coefficient equal to the coefficient of the middle term of 1 plus x to the power 2n these are the coefficient of 1 plus x to the power 2n minus 1 these are the coefficient of 1 plus 1 plus uh, x to the power 2n minus 1 these are the coefficient of and this is the coefficient of the middle terms of x 1 plus x to the power 2m this is the coefficient of the middle terms of 1 plus x to the power 2m these are the coefficient of the middle terms of 1 plus x to the power 2m minus 1 now we have to verify or we have to prove sum of these two terms equal to this term okay or uh, we can write c 2n minus 1 n minus 1 c uh, 2n minus 1 n equal to c 2n comma en so uh, we know that we have learned since c n r plus c n r minus 1 equal c n plus 1 comma r we have already learned this so following that pattern c n minus 1 and minus 1 like r and yes and one less mm. or this n this n minus 1 one less so you can write c 2n minus 1 comma n plus c 2n minus 1 n minus 1 equals c 2n comma 1 we have to verify just i have interchanged this so this following this pattern you know, n comma r n comma r and n comma r minus 1 that's why it will be n plus 1 comma r n plus 1 means c 2n minus 1 plus 1 comma r is what this is n equals c 2n comma 1 that's why this can be cancelled c 2n comma n equal c 2n comma n which is verified so from this case by another way i have solved this in another video i kept this from this step how to prove this but anyway you can uh, apply this condition that we have already proved and from this way we can verify the sum of the coefficient of 1 plus x to the power 2 n minus 1 equal to the coefficient of the middle term of both 1 plus x to the power 2 n in this way i believe you understand the solution of this question